4.30 Friday morning. Do you want discipline or do you want motivation? I'm not motivated to get up. I'm not motivated to work out. I'm not motivated to whatever, right? How are you not motivated? How? How do you not have motivation to do the shit you need to do? There's a difference between motivation and discipline. Motivation. You put on a YouTube or a, a reel or whatever, right? And there's some fast music and it shows some dude working out. And then it shows him building towards something, right? Rocky Balboa, the whole video was training for the fight. So then you see that and then you go out and you train. That's motivation. Discipline is what you need to do the shit you need to do, to do the shit you're supposed to do, to do the shit that brings rewards even when you don't want to. When you can do the shit you need to do when you don't want to do it, that's what makes the difference because oftentimes you're not motivated. See the difference? So which one do you want to have? <clears throat> and in doing that, <clears throat> in developing the discipline, in having the discipline, in practicing the shit you don't want to do that you know brings the reward, you yourself will become motivation. Somebody will see you do it. Some eyes will watch you do it. Somebody will consistently see you there. And then if you document it, you will become motivation for people that you don't even know. Somebody will watch, right? Somebody will see you do that shit. Don't tell your kids what you're going to do. Show your kids. You don't even have to point it out. They will watch it happen. That's the difference. I don't want to get up most mornings. A lot of mornings, though, I do. A lot of mornings, I'm excited to get up. Develop something that you're excited for. Do the hard thing, right? <clears throat> if you can't run, then walk. If you can't walk, take a few steps. And every day, one more step. Every day, one more minute, one more rep, one more pound, one more set. Six months ago, when I started messing with a jump rope, I hadn't jump roped in 45 years, probably. 45 years hadn't jump roped. I made a video. I think I got like three, and then I got like 11, and then I got 55, right, within a couple weeks. I don't even know how many I do now. I can't count them. I just do it for time now. I'm still getting better. My friend Lewis saw me because I made a video and I was doing it very poorly. And he showed up and he's like, hey, I think I can help you with this. He didn't say, do you want help? He didn't say, do you need help? He didn't say, do you have time? He showed up and said, I can fucking help you so that you can do this better. And within 15 minutes, he had me fucking doing it completely better complete different technique, everything about it. I don't want to jump rope, but every time I jump rope, it's difficult to breathe and I completely feel it in different places in my body. So that tells me that I need to do that. So I develop the discipline to do that because I want the rewards that come from it. So between each set, when I go in there and I'm doing bench press, after I do my reps and I put that bar down, I go and I do jump rope. And I do jump rope between every set of weights. Every time I set the weight down, I go and do jump rope. Because I feel that it adds to me because it's difficult for me to do. Same with the Concept 2 rower. The treadmill is the easiest thing to do. I get on there, I can knock out an hour before you know it, the hour's over if I have fucking content that I'm consuming, watching, right? But the Concept 2 rower is difficult. The stair stepper is difficult. That's why I do those things, because it is harder. They say uh, do cardio at a level where it's difficult to hold a conversation, but you can still hold a conversation. That's why I do that. If there was somebody next to me when I'm on the stair stepper, I wouldn't be able to have a conversation with them. I definitely could on the treadmill, though. It's easier. It's a lot lower impact. So which do you want? Do you want motivation or discipline? All these guys watch all these videos, but when you zoom back and you look at their social media or you zoom back and actually look at their life if you know them, 
It doesn't look like that motivation's doing anything fucking for their life. Like the success zombies. They show up at all the seminars and they pay five grand or ten grand and they pay thirty grand. But nothing changes in their life. Try not to-